What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. For those that are new here, hi, my name is Rochelle and I like to make thrifting and fashion videos along with a little bit of beauty and just sharing my life with you guys over here on my little corner of the internet. For today's video, I'm doing something a little bit different. One of my favorite companies to work with here on YouTube, New Air, ended up sending me over a portable air conditioner, which I thought was awesome. I think it was last year that they sent me a like swamp cooler, water cooler fan, which you guys can see in a lot of my the backgrounds of my videos because I keep it in my living room. It's just this really cute cute little white cute little fan I I love it so much you can put water in it to cool to use it as a swamp cooler or you could just use it as a fan which I do for my dogs all the time and I've also showed you guys their mini fridge that they sent me which is amazing I used it for quite a while as a little mini fridge for drinks and stuff in our office I did end up gifting it to a friend who has a trailer and needed a new fridge in their trailer and he uses it on a normal basis and absolutely loves it. So when Neo Air reached out about this portable air conditioning, you guys know I was on it since it is so stinking hot here, you guys. I live in the mountains of Northern California and where I live, it is very dry and hot all summer long. 10 day forecast has been in the hundreds the whole entire time. It's hot here. If we're not at the lake, we're at home. I figured it'd be great to try out a portable air conditioner and that way I can also just leave it on in one room if I don't want to air condition my entire house. So we're going to unbox it today. So thank you so much New Air for sending this over and sponsoring this video for my channel. said you guys I have two elder dogs. They are both 12 years old. This is Tegan and here is the big one Ziggy. Like I said, they are both senior dogs and so I like to just make sure that they're nice and comfortable whenever I go leave to go thrifting and in the summertime it's just really important to me that they are nice and air conditioned while i'm gone all right you guys here it is first impressions this on looks is it so cute i like how like basic and clean looking it is it doesn't have like a bunch of like stuff all over it the top, top is just black and I like that it's white because I feel like that just like fits in with my personal aesthetic, which is really nice. I'm not sure if it comes in other colors. I think it only comes in white, but I could be wrong. And the top has all of like the timers, modes, up and down, speeds. To be responsible and read the owner's manual to figure out how exactly this thing works. And then I'll let you guys know. This is the window I will be installing it in. And what you do for the hose vent is you actually just put this little piece into the window, which will hose vent right here. And then you can close the window until it hits that piece. And I will say upon reading the manual that the window has to be a specific like length because of the window slider kit. So if you see behind my couch right here, we have pretty um, big windows and they open this way. So it's this length that opens instead of like up, if that makes sense. Actually can't install the window slider into this window because these windows are too tall. So for this unit, this is the width size that you want the window to be. But I, what I really like about that is that you can move it throughout the house because that little slider tool is very easy to install. It just slides and then you put the little pegs in and you insert it in the window. So I could move the unit around my house depending on where I want the unit to be as long as it fits the window in that room. This unit also does have a water tray that you will eventually have to remove the water from which is what this little pipe is for, is to drain the water. And it also comes with a cute little remote control that you can do all of the temperature up, down operating mode, fan speed, sleep mode, etc. on. Okay, here we are in my bedroom and I just put the unit right over here. And I'm just taking the hose that comes out of the back that we just installed and you clip it into the piece that you put in the window. Oh, so easy, okay. And then we just wanna make sure that the window is closed as much as possible to the extender. And then heading into the back of your unit. Great, right, we're just gonna turn the unit on for the first time. Oh, okay, oh wow. 
turned right on this little lever like went up it has the temperature on the front right here okay this is the different temperature you can go all the way down to 61 is the lowest it does have just the fan mode if you want to go to fan and then it also has dehumidify it has a timer I'm not sure how long the timer is for. Ooh, oscillate on the fan. It ends up um, lifting and dropping the lid when it oscillates. <laughs> Feels good. Okay, and then it also has a sleep mode. Let's try medium. Ooh, yeah, okay. And then this is high. Nice. For the sleep mode, it will be at the desired starting temperature and then it'll increase by two degrees after one hour and four degrees after two hours. And then, but I guess it doesn't turn off while you're sleeping, so. And then there is an alarm when the water tray is full and that's when you just use that other hose to remove the water. All right, to test this little guy out, I think what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna turn off my air conditioning to my entire house. And then I'm just going to run this one in here and see the difference of the temperature between my living room and my bedroom. So I'll check in with you guys a little while and let you guys know how it goes. It's been about two hours, I got some work done and, and now I'm gonna go check in on the room. I haven't been in there since we turned it on. So I just checked the thermometer and out here in the living room area, it's 85 degrees, which is pretty warm. I feel like I'm not dying, but I'm not cool. <laughs> so let's see what the bedroom feels like. If I can feel a difference. Oh yeah, immediately. Much cooler in here. The unit is going strong, so is the fan blowing. Hope you guys can hear me. I'm gonna give you my first impressions and thoughts on this unit. I would say that if you have a smaller, like studio type apartment or room, this would definitely kind of cool down the whole area. Would this be sufficient for like an entire house? No, I don't think so. But I know that a lot of people right now are experiencing really, really high heat that aren't used to it. Like I think it was Seattle was hitting like 100 degrees and that never happens in Seattle. And so if you live somewhere that isn't normally this hot and because of you know, good old global warming, lots of temperature changes, lots of droughts going on. So if you live in a situation like that, where you have a small area or like you don't have air conditioning, I know a lot of places in the Bay Area here in California, they actually don't even have air conditioning units because they don't normally need them. And so if you have a situation like that, I think this would be perfect for that situation. Or if you maybe live with roommates and you want to try to keep the bill down in the central area and you just want to only cool your one room, small areas, maybe even if you have like a studio or like a, a granny unit, a tiny home, a granny unit, anything like that. I think that this would be perfect for that sort of situation. I'm really gonna enjoy having this in our bedroom and not having to cool down the whole house at nighttime or just when I know that I'm hanging out in one specific room. I think it's also really great that you can just put it in different wall units. Like you don't have to keep it in this one room. The only downside is it does require the window unit and the unit has to be close to the window. You can't just move this all around your house anywhere that there's a plug since it does have to have an outlet to go out the window. That's the only con that I can really see as of right now. As long as you can get the outtake tube into the window and you could have the unit next to the window. I think that it's great, it works wonderful. It is a little bit noisy, I would say, if you're looking for something very quiet as well. This might not be the unit for you, but in general, it sounds about like a fan. So if you have just like a normal fan and that kind of white noise doesn't bother you, I would say that this is maybe a little bit noisier than like an oscillating fan. But if that doesn't bother you, personally for me, I don't like it to be extremely quiet when I'm sleeping. I like a little bit of noise in the background, white noise. But other than that, those are the only cons I can see from this unit. I love it. Thank you so much New Air for sending this over. I'm going to definitely enjoy this. I'm, my dogs are really going to enjoy it when I'm gone and trying to keep them cool. I will put my link in the description box down below. I also have a coupon code to get a little discount off as well. Thank you so much New Air and I will see you guys next time. Okay, bye.